everyone, my name's Claire and today I'm going to be running the Christmas bauble workshop. To make my baubles um, I've chosen to use treasure that I found on walks that I've been doing through lockdown. <laughs> What we're going to do first of all is we're going to add a little bit of frost to the pine cone. So our little elf has been scurrying around in the woods on a cold morning and he's just got a few little speckles of frost on his on his little petals. So what we do is we take our glue and with an old paintbrush we just we just uh, paint the tips of the pine cone with a little bit of glue. Now PVA glue will dry back fairly see-through so you, you don't want it too regimented you just want little bits of glue on the ends of these I'm calling them petals but on the end of these petals here as you can see okay and when you've kind of got a nice dab all the way round doesn't have to be terribly even we just get our glitter and we give it a little shake on top of the pine cone and you'll find that it will just rest nicely on all the little bits of glue that you've got. Make sure that you have cut out the template so you've got one for the hat and you've got one for the scarf. Take the template for our hat and place it onto our felt. Okay and from there what we do is we just using a pencil we just draw around the shape. And from there, what I'm going to do is take a nice sharp pair of scissors and I'm just going to cut around that pencil mark. So when you've done that, we're going to make sure that the next thing we do is to put our little hanging string inside the hat. We need 18 centimetres. If you look, you'll see that there's a more rounded edge to the top of the hat and I'm going to put a little drop of glue just in the middle. I'm then going to fold my string in half and I'm going to place the two ends onto the glue and just give that a few seconds just to, just to set. So the next part is we want to roll the hat into a cone. We're going to practice before we actually secure it down so that we know we've got the edges right. Okay, and once I'm happy that I've got a nice shape and I'm in control of what I'm doing, I'm now going to put a piece of glue along that edge there. So that's when it's opened, if the hat is facing you with the string facing outwards. When I've done that, I'm going to work quite quickly because the glue does set quite fast. So. Hopefully what you can see now is that we've got the shape of our hat, it's started to form. Now at this point, this is where you can either leave the hat completely plain or you can decorate it and to decorate it you can use anything from uh, little round um, dots of felt, you can use um, sparkly stars, you could put a bell on the top. The next thing we've got to do is to attach the hat to our elf's head and for that we use one of the little wooden baubles. Now bear in mind there'll be a hole at the top of the bottom and what we want to do is to hide the hole. So using my glue gun I'm going to place a little line of glue just around the inside rim of the hat. So here we go. And I'm just turning my hat nicely as I go. Just slightly inside. Okay. And then I'm going to pop my ball just inside so as if the hole goes inside the hat. And then I just use my fingers to feed it down a little bit. Just give that a few minutes to dry. Okay, so there you can see we've got the starts of a nice little elf. So when we've done that the next thing we need to do is to attach that to our pine cone. So taking your glue gun you need to do quite a nice generous dollop of lovely hot glue 
around that top of the bauble. And then we, we pop the bauble onto the pine cone there. Now just, just be patient here, just give this a couple of minutes for the glue to start to set. We'll just take a couple of minutes, not, not long, but don't rush it. So the next thing you need to do is to make the scarf. So again, just, just cut the scarf out from the template. And in the same way as you did the hat, place it onto your felt and draw around your shape. So I like to have, that's the back of my hat, so work out the back. And obviously you like to have a nice little bit of the hat at the front. And then he's nonchalantly slung the scarf over his shoulder. So what we do is you, you place it around and then we just give it a nice little glue. So a little dollop of glue on one side of the hat, ring the scarf around and just press it down with a little bit of glue. And there we go, he's, he's, got, his, he's got his scarf. So all that leaves us to do now is to bring our little elf to life with a face. And for that, we use our fine marker pens. Don't rush this part. Think very carefully about where you want to place the eyes and what sort of expression you want him to have. You know, is he happy? Is he sad? Is he, you know, being cheeky? So now you can see our little elf has got a gorgeous scarf, a lovely hat, a nice hanging string, and on the pine cone that I did here, we've learnt how to add the frost. I hope you've had fun making your baubles and I hope you go ahead and make lots more. It's been lovely doing the workshop and I hope I get to see you all again soon. But in the meantime, I'd like to wish you all a very Merry Christmas. Thank you.